Welcome back to Pam's Blog Vibes. I'm Pam, and if you're new here, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching in advance. And so today, what I am going to be doing is I've already went out. It's about 12-ish. So I've already went out this morning. It was some an errand that I had to take care of, and so I did do that, and I did come back, and then I did have to stop at the, the bank to do some things, but I took care of that as well. And so I'm back. I also stopped at the post office, and so I did that. And so that's a done deal. And so now today I'm back. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to take care of some laundry that's been long overdue. Uh, I want to show you this unit, as you can see in back of me right here. Try to get it neat and organized and looking much better than what it is looking like. So that's going to be going on. I also have some laundry here that I'm going to be folding and getting that taken care of. And so I also have some meal prepping I'm going to be doing today. So I did do some meal prepping about two days ago. And so I'm going to show you guys this week's meal prep, but I do have some footage from the pre-recorded meal prep that I did and I'm gonna show you guys that now so I got some barbecue chicken here and then I did put the date there and then with the chicken I am going to have some mixed vegetables and then I did make some some rice with that looks good looks good and so I have that going and then I'm going to be doing some tacos and then I'm going to be doing some spaghetti. So we're going to see how it comes out. I'm going to give you guys an update. And so now on the stove I have the ground beef cooking for the spaghetti and then I'm going to have some ground beef cooking for the tacos. This is my spaghetti just part in the steam but it's simmering here and it's going to be ready pretty soon so that's how far I've gotten to be using this Prego roasted garlic herb mix to my ground beef now and so we're gonna get that going so look at this I got all of the juices and flavor blending together I got the onions the tomatoes I did add some garlic sauce so this is tasting very very good it is delicious it's simmering and all of those flavors are mixing together so yeah so guys i'm all finished i'm all done this is my three-day meal prep i decided because i was cooking some barbecue chicken today i might as well go ahead and cook the rest for the week and so this will be three days of meals dinners and so i did do the barbecue chicken i did do the rice i also did some vegetables with the barbecue chicken and rice this is my spaghetti for tomorrow this is the sauce for it looking good looking good and then this is my tacos and i will be doing some lettuce tomatoes with that and so yeah guys why not why not
so I did replace the vase and cleaned it and put it back and I also cleaned the picture but I did add this holster plant that I picked up from Home Depot it's got a little baby seedling there but I did pick it up from Home Depot and then I cleaned out the drawer area the container areas I did add this vase with a candle and then I put my statue mother statue back there and just put the two drawers that i had i put one here and then i put one there so it's real simple but i like it i think it's super super cute super super neat there's the sunlight and it's really nice really nice super cute i love it I'm thinking about getting a little small tray and putting it here, some sort of tray, and then possibly if I could find a nice picture to go in this area here. If not, then I may put some shelving here, but yeah. And this right here is M&M chocolate chip cookies. My son just made them and he offered some to me. So I am going to slightly indulge because they look so yummy. Can't wait to try one. Like I said before, guys, I just try to eat healthier. I do have a snack or a treat or some type of dessert every now and then, but I don't overdo it so i may eat these today but then i won't see these again for a while so yeah looks good so let's go into the kitchen and i am going to show you how i do some of my meal prepping so today i got some pork egg rolls some chicken egg rolls and some shrimp egg rolls and we are going to do a little bit of mini meal prepping for this week so i got this white meat chicken egg roll you get four i picked it up from walmart it's the great value brand and then i did get the pork egg rolls it also has four so i picked these two up on my walmart plus and then i also got the I want to say Thai pie, shrimp egg rolls. I did pick those up from Walmart as well. You get eight in the box. It does come with these sauces. So I'm going to show you the sauce that it came with. It came with the sauce, the sauce, the sweet and sour sauce. So I do have three of those. And so I did put them in the oven. And I got my rice going. It is cooking. So I got that going. So I did cook all of the egg rolls. These are the four chicken egg rolls. And these are the pork. The smaller ones like these here are the shrimp. And so yeah, let's get started.
remember the two packs of, well, three packs of the sweet and sour sauce that came with the egg rolls. I will be adding one pack of that as well. So this is how I came out. I have the fried rice where I put the onions, a little garlic powder, and seasoning. And I did add a dab of soy sauce. So I have that. And then I do have that to go with the egg rolls. This is the chicken and the pork egg rolls. And so I also have the shrimp egg rolls as well. Nice, crunchy, and ready to be eaten. And then look guys, I have another thing of shrimp. Well, this is not shrimp, but it's fried rice. And what I'm gonna do when I get ready to cook it, I'm going to add some shrimp. And so it's all set. Just needs the shrimp to be added. And so that is my prep for this week. So, don't mind my face. I know it is glistening. <laughs> I have been in the kitchen, and so that is my meal prep. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and until the next video, bye.